Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. We are on part 36 of the Sims 4 Super Next Generation series. So last part we ended off with the renewal of vows between uh, Connor and Luna. Um, and we were at the Van Haunt Mansion uh, estate, but now <laughs> I actually wanted to do a dance party. And for some reason I'm not able to do the dance party at the estate, so I decided to go to... Uh, the island bluffs so we just transferred over here and currently we are starting a dance party I'm not sure why Lucian is streaking right now but he is at the moment um, let me bring Arlo as well um, yeah so we're just gonna it's gonna be short because um, tomorrow we have to have them wake up and everything so it won't be that long not longer than midnight, so I, I might have to cancel it a little bit earlier, if so. Um, but just to, you know, like a reception type of thing. Um, yeah, so let's get this part started. Okay, so the DJ hasn't arrived. I think um, the DJ comes on their own. I don't know. I think so, because last time I also was confused, and then I had... This one work in the rain. Ah, oh. That sucks. I mean, we could still dance. <laughs> what did I just do? What is this group wedding dance? I kinda... Um... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Lucian's totally out of sync. I guess it kind of works since this is a renewal, a vow renewal type of thing. Oh my gosh. Or maybe he's like better at dancing. I don't know. I think Connor would be better even though he hates it. Yeah, he's at level 4. Connor's at level 4. Even though he dislikes it. He dances a lot. <laughs> it's cool to see them all in sync, though. Um, She's ordering a drink. Arlo's still over there. Oh, bonfire. I didn't know that we have a bonfire here. Why don't you add fuel? <laughs> Play. Ooh. Oh, your fur. Ooh, Connor. Jeez, everyone's starting on fire. I'd be most worried about werewolves because they're fur, right? Like, I could see them just catching on fire and not being able to extinguish. What did you order? Sweet and spicy? This is my uh, guess. Oh, Grace. Sweet and spicy. I think I am right. Yes. Tell dramatic story. Oh, she's hurt by somebody. Express admiration. You're my best friend. Ask about day. I think we invited Lucy to the party. If I just missed her, she might have left or she didn't. Oh, there's a group here. Oh, there's the DJ. Oh, he can't do anything because it's raining. Darn it. Who was that? It's not her. Dang, I guess she didn't come. That's okay. Oh, uh, I bet it's going out faster because it's raining. I keep forgetting. <laughs> Why don't you come dig here? Maybe we can get something valuable at some simoleons. Quick woohoo with Luna? <laughs> Why not? Oh, she really needs to go to the bathroom. 
Can it stop raining for maybe an hour at least? Capsule. How much is a capsule? Uh, I guess let's open it up. Oh, somebody fertilized it already. Jenna. <laughs> Morbia. More cubis. <laughs> Thought of Morbius. Um, she's just like, ooh, well, I just, you know. Best spin fizz out of Star Wars. Um, Lucian. <laughs> ooh, wild pear tree. I kind of want pears. Oh, no, 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 no. I thought uproot meant, like, we're taking it. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> well, that was bad. <laughs> I can't believe it has to rain. We should have done the dance party inside somewhere. It's all right. Um... We actually have Simon here, so he's part of the werewolf group. Uh, let's let's not um, become werewolves. I'm thinking our needs will go all all wonky because uh, normally it does when we turn into werewolves. We're gonna have to take a day where we're all gonna go on a hunt. I keep forgetting that we need to like do more werewolf things with the family, but. I'm thinking maybe in the next generation, Arlo will be more into figuring out, you know, all the werewolf stuff and having fun with that. I mean, t we could take a deeper look into it. I just wanted one slow dance before we're done. <laughs> Let's see if this glitches out. Looking good so far. Oh, This is actually really nice when it doesn't like glitch way out. Alright, let's end- I already said at midnight. It's past midnight. Let's end the dance party. We can't really dance because uh, it's raining. So that's okay. Let's go home. We are going to open up. Why am I bringing everybody with me? We are going to open up the vet clinic in the morning, so we definitely have to go home, get some sleep. Arlo's coming with us. Did we get everybody? Yeah. And we're going to go home. So I will see you guys when we get there. Alright guys, so I honestly just put them to sleep last night, um, and they've all woken up, well, except Lucian. Um, oh, now he is. He heard me. <laughs> um, Arlo already went off to school, but Connor is retired, technically. Oh, and it also looks like for his pension, he is getting 349 simoleons um, every day. Not much, but better than nothing. Uh, why don't you repair that and then mop? Um, I think she needed to take a shower quick. So once we get everything settled at home, I'm actually going to head over to the vet clinic with everybody because um, Luna has the day off as well, so all three of them can go and help out. It's been a while since I've opened up a vet clinic, so don't remember much um, so this is gonna be a process <laughs> oh somebody is anybody sick princess Luke looked okay they look fine too I think just taking a shower I'm gonna have him come over here let's clean the shed let's not have a erratic moment 
Let's clean empty bowl. And then we can fill them. They probably um, ate the spoiled food, and that's what happened. Um, all we have is chicks left. Hopefully they grow up soon. <laughs> Sell that upgrade part. Alright. I already checked on the litter box. I think Arlo took that out. Before he left. Uh, why are the lot talks... Toxes, taxes so high. Um, stress teacher. The teacher has to run out and pick up his medications, so he asks the class to sit quietly and do their reading assignment while he's gone. Should Arlo do that or try to do some other homework while he's at the has the chance? Let's do the reading. <laughs> I'm too afraid to be caught. Okay. Let's uh, pay those bills. They're quite high. <clears throat> also, we haven't looked at the uh, neighborhood action plans. <laughs> I had it on there, and then I just forgot to look at it. Free love. Who needs negativity when you could be drenched in love? Who needs jealousy when you could be embraced with understanding? Oh, whether we're single, married, or just open, we embrace loving each other in its beautiful forms. Wow. Now, does that mean, like, if somebody cheats or something, they won't get a negative reaction? I don't know. I'm not so sure about free love. Um, rock your body. It doesn't sound too bad. Uh, Self-sufficiency. Sounds good, too. And tech support. Alright, they're all not too bad. There's a few, like, rough housing courage I wouldn't like. Power conservation that annoys me a bit. Um, otherwise, they're they're not too bad. So let's leave it as is. I want it to scatter feed. It's a good thing she's still getting royalty. Oh yeah, he could still be painting though too, and he could be getting a bunch of simoleons that way. Let's try to paint a little bit before we leave. Um, normally on a normal day, I'd probably try to get to the vet clinic for 8 a.m. Um, once we get there, we can figure out how that's all going to work out. Um, and how I'm going to, if I'm going to hire anybody or whatnot. Let's call over Bianca. I'm sure she needs something. Or not. Let's talk about llama economics. <laughs> I wanted to hug Bianca. Let's, oh, she didn't like that. Oh, well, she let us hug her. Share Bianca's wool. Fluffy llama hugs. Aw. Well, I think she's gotten used to the sharing of wool. <laughs> Alright. Oh. Is this for Arlo, I think? Hmm. Um. Oh no, somebody's fighting. Did you finish your painting? Also, did we have... I can't remember. I'm gonna see who the, who's fighting. Who was it? Flash and Luke. <gasps> You're fighting with your father. That's not good. She didn't finish that. Alright, let's not worry about it. No painting, no writing for today. We are going to help Lucian with his vet clinic. Uh, he never went up there. Nice. Alright, let us go all together. Jefferson. No Jefferson. <laughs> and Connor. So, I will see you guys when we get to the vet clinic. <clears throat> yeah, so I have it here placed in Henford on Bagley, so it's quite close. Um, but yeah, so I will see you guys when we arrive. Okay, so we are here. Alright, I'm going to have to figure out 
how I get all this. Okay, maybe it's something to do with buy mode. Um, I know I could choose vet outfit clinics. <laughs> what did I just say? Vet clinic staff outfits. Um, I swear there was a way. This allowed new customers. No. Um, how do I do this? It's been a while since I have uh, run a vet clinic. Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> it has it has been a while. Currently closed. Okay. So what do we have to do to open? Just press open. So I transferred 4,000 funds. Let's look at business perks quick. Oh. Okay. Manage employees. View. Let's see, maybe we can get one employee so they could be there. Maybe two. Oh, we can only hire one. So for right now, we're definitely gonna have to stay at the vet clinic for a while. Make sure we can help out. Everybody is at the same level for the vet skill, it looks like. All right, so then I guess I'm basing it off charisma skill. <laughs> and it looks like Luna is the best. Because everybody else landed on the same thing for the vet skill and handedness. So let's do Luna. Yes. And she can always be like the receptionist and whatever, just help out. But, all right. So we hired an employee. Settings, price 100%. Advertising, no, not right now. I guess we are good where we at. So let's open it quick and see what we can do. Lucian has hired a new vet. Luna Munch will arrive for her first shift as possible, soon as possible. All right. <clears throat> I probably should have gotten his vet clinic skill up. He doesn't have anything. Um, do lab work. Let's see. I don't know if that's the science skill or what. Okay, so she's back here. Oh, we have our first patient come in. Okay, good. He required the vet skill. All right. Perfect. All right. Greet patient warmly. Let's do it. Sure, Grace. I'm actually going to have... Since there's a computer here and we can do that. I'm going to come have her come over here and continue writing her book. Or not. <laughs> it's not allowing me. My dog bandit has been doing well, but it's time for his checkup. Okay. We can exam. Okay, so he just does that automatically. Let's see how he does on his first patient. Hold on, I need to take a, just a quick snap of this. Connor in the background. Oh no, we have another patient. I wonder if our employee is going to come in or not. Are we supposed to be doing something? I don't know. Okay. Exam. Examine mouth. Eye exam. Exam. 
Listen. Oh. Calm patient, calm pet. He'll be okay. That's good. All right. Try to not catch Connor in every picture here. <laughs> All right, he has calmed the patient down. Take temperature. Oh, looks like he's healthy. Prevented? Do we do that? Wait, what are we? <laughs> I'm too afraid to make the wrong thing. Okay, so he has normal temperature, uh, healthy cuteness levels, responsive ears, clean nose. <clears throat> Should we be checking? Anything else? I don't know. Um, listen to heart. <clears throat> I want to make sure that we don't just uh, let him go. Oh, there's Luna. Healthy. Okay. Perfect. Well, he looks healthy. Wait, what was that? Be mean, call a good pet. Oh my. The wait times here were short and sweet. Oh, so maybe we're done? Uh, dismiss patient. I don't know if they just go on their own or do we have to dismiss them? <clears throat> Checking over here if Luna... Are you going? Is she going to? Okay, she is. Okay, perfect. This works. <clears throat> Call a good pet. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um. Should we dismiss her? I guess so. Okay. Are those back from home? Let's go greet. Oh. Oh, what happened? I guess we're not supposed to be dismissing patients. Whoops. Well, that didn't work out. Something is wrong with my little girl, Ducky. Won't you please help her? Sure. I'm just uh, checking out what Luna is doing over here. Well, well, now we know not to dismiss our patients. Um, Feral. He's not happy. I'm going to let him deal with his needs and then maybe we'll bring him over in a little bit. <clears throat> All right, I hope we can do better on this one. Ooh, he's not happy. Let's calm him. <laughs> Cone of shame. <laughs> oh my goodness. <clears throat> it looks like he has a skin fur issue going on, so I think I'm, that's going to be my first inspection. Oh, there's another patient? Oh my goodness. Oh, at least they like how it looks. Alright, icy fur. Let me just check if he has anything going on. I feel like if we... Ch we, uh... Take a look. 
eye exam. Let's do that. <clears throat> we take a look at what the, how they look. That could help us to figuring out what we should examine. Okay, low temperature. Listen to heart. Oh, we reached level two. Pet themed mailboxes. Oh. Let's calm him down one more time. <clears throat> Alright, looks like she could probably grab the next patient. Um, next, I guess we can listen to breathing. Uh, not right now. <clears throat> um, technically at work. <laughs> All right. Examine mouth. He, they have low temperature, so I was like, we shouldn't take temperature, but maybe that's indicate. Okay, there we go. Icebox fever. So then, oh, okay. I guess it's with the thumbs up. All right. Right. I'm so afraid now of doing the wrong thing, but let's do that. Perfect. Carrot sickness. Lucia has completed examining and treated Ducky. Should be feeling much better now. <clears throat> let's still eat. Alright. Well, at least she, she liked us. I think like at 6 p.m., we should definitely close. So that's going to be our last patient. So what do we... I guess they just leave on their own. Yeah, let's go to the bathroom and then we're going to greet Cassandra. I'm glad everybody likes how the vet looks. <laughs> it took a long time to build this vet. Not too long, but long enough. Okay. Wash your hands. And then we're going to come over here. Luna and Connor just hanging out, I guess. I still wanted to try one more time and see if it works. What is... Why can't she... Alright, Loki means the world to me and she has been feeling awful lately. Whatever you can do to help will be greatly appreciated. Sure. Man, Lucy really wants to hang out. <clears throat> Should probably bring the cats over next time, I'm thinking, since they can enjoy. Well, then again, they'll probably get sick from the pets, so maybe not. I don't know. Okay, perfect. Alright, yeah, so definitely... I'm sorry, but we'll be closing after this. All right, so they're having, I bet, I bet, eye exam, starry eyes or something like that. Oh, humor and hijinks. Sorry, Grace. Alright. Yeah, so we definitely got one. Um, listen to breathing. <laughs> Examine mouth. Let's calm them down. How are you doing over here? All right. So that went pretty pretty well. Let's take temperature, maybe. Wow, he already went to level three <laughs> on the first day.
Hmm. Test ears. Maybe that will work. Alright. Looks like we don't need to know exactly what's going on with the... Cured sickness. Lucian has completed examining and treating Loki. She should be feeling much better now. Alright, unfortunately you're going to have to end because we'd be here all day. Alright. I'm going to close. So we went up a little bit. Uh, oh wow, we did gain a bit more uh, in money. Um, we just have to pay Luna. I think that's what the wages owed is. Um... So, we did pretty well. So, the good thing is, is the reviews came with ambience. Try cleaning up your clinic or adding better furniture. What? Everybody liked, liked our vet clinic. I don't know. Bedside minor, try being more attentive to your patients when you're treating them. Wait time, your vet clinic has very short wait times, which are great for those customers needing urgent care. Okay. Neutral. Alright. Definitely gotta be nice. So, thankfully, it looks like she skilled up in her vet skill. That's good. So, it looks pretty good for the first day, I think. Alright. So, we closed. So, we're gonna go home now. <clears throat> Actually, let me see if I'm able to... What was it? Perks. Perks. So, actually, we do have... We are able to do maybe one of these top four things. So, maybe we'll get an additional vet. Um, so that we don't have to be at the vet clinic at all times. Uh, probably better to get one now. Second one, so that they level up their vet skill. Um, vet rush. Uh, let's not do that. <laughs> um, makes pet owners easier to impress them with quick service and less likely to get. Hmm. That sounds like a good one too. I'm thinking let's do the additional vet and I think next time maybe we'll get the patient patients. <laughs> That's actually that one. Those words. They're a little confusing there for a second. Um, all right, additional vet. Let's do that quick. And let's hire them, and then we're going to go home. So, let's see. <clears throat> it looks like, again, everybody's at the same skill level for vet clinic and handiness. So, I'm going to go based off of charisma. So, it's looking between Jenna, Akito, and Malcolm Landgrab. I think I'm going to go with Akito. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't want land grab, uh, just because nothing against land grabs, but yeah, it's a little bit something against land grabs. Um, they're not my favorite family, so it was between Jenna or Akito, and thinking I'm going to go with Akito. So let's do that. So perfect. Oh no. All right. Yep. So tomorrow we're definitely going to open the vet clinic, but we're going to let our two employees handle it and we're going to hang out with Connor for the day since it looks like he's getting closer to death, unfortunately. But let's head home. <clears throat> oh, he's making food for himself. Okay, let's let him grab food, eat, and then we're going to head out. But I think we did pretty well for our first day at the vet clinic. I hope, you know, it goes well. Um, we didn't bring Arlo, but Arlo's having his own own thing going on right now. <laughs> also, he's technically part of the club cosplay group. Um, but I'm thinking we're going to create a new group, new club, so Arlo could be the leader and 
I don't know. We'll see. Thinking maybe we can do like a werewolf type of thing. But then we don't have uh, that requirement for werewolves since, you know, um, it's a mod and it wouldn't be on there. All right, so he's finished. Let us head home. <clears throat> maybe if this new game pack that comes out soon is a werewolf pack, um, maybe that will be a thing. So maybe we'll see. All right, I will see you guys when we get there. So we are back. Let me just check on Arlo because I haven't seen him all day. Oh, he seems kind of unhappy. I feel like he should have an A in school, but it's okay. He needs his fun level up, so we'll let him do that. Um, she's going to the bathroom. I'm going to have her try to finish that book. I'm going to have him try to come up here and do the painting. He never listens to me. Luna. <clears throat> Let's try to finish this. I think Lucian... Oh! Stop scratching. Princess, the second. It's time to be... Let's see if it comes up again. There we go. Maybe that can go towards his goal. Training out misbehaviors. Oh! That's not nice. But it's fine. All right, maybe you can go chat with Lucian because social need for free throws. Yeah, uh, maybe you can go and do that and get your fun level skill up. Skill, skill, no. Why don't you come join Lucian? <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I don't... Oh, oh my goodness. Why do you keep leaving <clears throat> your work half done? Ooh. 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 <laughs> Hold on. It's probably really inspired. Can they do that at the same time? I think so. And can you guys chat? <clears throat> Excuse me, my goodness, my voice always... It's the season of uh, seasonal allergies that keeps messing with my sinuses and throat. Oh, it looks like he just stopped playing. <clears throat> Maybe they, they can... Uh, let's just let them... Do whatever. I want them to chat for a little bit. Banter with old friend. Okay, you don't have to stand right in front of him. <laughs> Give family advice. I want him to tell him about his uh, day as a vet. Um, ask about his day. Oh, it looks like he got a new sentiment. Deep personal conversation. We'll say they're talking about future and all that. You know what? It's been wonderful to spend time with you. We've made some great memories and we'll make many more, I'm sure of it. Deeply connected and growing closer from quality time. That's sweet. He has friendly advice on here. Motivating sentiments. Alright. <clears throat> I'm I really wanted them to be like really close since they're brothers. And I think they'll stay together for a while yet. Sell to publisher. Let's sell our book. Make some more dough. <laughs> He's almost not done up there. I really like this painting. <laughs> But we're going to sell it because we <clears throat> definitely need to. Oh, he still hasn't renewed vows. 
She does too. Okay. I didn't even notice. Let's give some offer friendship. Let's see if uh, Luke will accept our friendship. And then I'm going to put her to sleep. I think he is. Okay, thank goodness. Of course, of course. Excellent. Um, <laughs> I'm thinking of keeping it, but let's sell it. Let's sell it. Yeah. Okay, it looks like she's already going to bed. When is Love Day? Yeah, I don't think Connor's gonna make it to Love Day. <laughs> Terrible. Wait, I thought she had off for the next... Oh, it's after midnight. Okay, perfect. She does have off. Um, so, definitely gonna hang out with Connor for the day. I am gonna put them to bed. <clears throat> They're all kind of tired. What are you doing? Flash. As long as you're not scratching the furniture, I swear. Alright. I'm gonna put him to sleep. Why did you wake up? Somebody wake you up. Ah. I'm not sure about waking up. That's also another pet peeve of mine. Where are you? Like sure about waking up. Come here. Come here. Oh my goodness. Get up here. I need to do this. <clears throat> All right. Um oh, he's still up there. Okay. He's going to go to sleep. He's almost done with his painting. Okay. Go ahead and go to sleep. <clears throat> Maybe next time he'll uh, learn that misbehavior. Uh, once he's done with the painting, I'm going to sell it. This one's interesting too. And I'm going to put him to sleep. So, oh, there we go. Let's sell it. And he's going to go to sleep. So, uh, I'm going to end this part here. So tomorrow, like I mentioned, I'm going to open the vet clinic, but I'm not going to have them uh, head over. I'm going to let the two employees handle it for the day, uh, just so we can hang out with Connor um, and do something since <laughs> his end is getting closer. <laughs> um, I'm not sure what we're going to do, but we'll see. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!